Well, I'm getting ready to go. Somewhere I misplaced my camera I was using this morning. Somewhere in my truck or in the garage. I got my truck loaded. Pigeons. They eat the bird seed that Chris puts out for the birds. She hates them. Okay, off we go. Well, it's Saturday morning. I cut the grass yesterday. My pressure washed the parts of the backyard and etc. etc. It's a shade before 10. The knife gig was canceled because of rain. They canceled the knife gig Thursday while we was having the other gig. But so far we haven't had any rain whatsoever. There's supposed to be a 100% chance all day. I just got back from the Mumbles Man's. Look at that. That's what was in my tire. My other tire. God. Look at that sucker. Mumbles Man fixed her though. We had a jacker up take the tire off so we could get to it, so he could get to it easier. So now I got a plug in this tire right there, and I got a plug in the other tire right in the center. Mumbles man had a pretty fair day yesterday. He didn't get any gold, but he found a really nice uh, button. I think he said it was a World War I Army button. I'll put a picture of it in there so you can see it. Beaver went last night. He didn't do much. It's been slow, other than that button and a little bit of some clad and stuff. That's all the boys have found up lately. So I haven't really missed much other than the exercise part of it, which I need. Probably try to go tomorrow. Surf Church Sunday. That mama's man said he can't go. He's got some honeydews. Birthday party for one of the grandkids. I don't know. The weather's supposed to be nice tomorrow. It's not supposed to be no rain or anything. It's supposed to be chillier. The temperature's going to drop. But I don't know. You know, nothing spectacular by no means. Okay. I'll go inside now and see what the critters are doing. <laughs> oh, the lady of the house is painting. We had a new garage door put in. I think I told you. She's doing some Final trim work. Well, it looks like everybody's reclining today. <laughs> I'm reclining. Jack's reclining. What are you doing in there? You little munchkins, you. What are you doing in there? You've been resting? You've been playing all morning while well, I've been gone. Poor Jack. She chases him around the yard when they're playing ball. She bites on his back feet. Like an alligator. She chases him and bites him. But he tolerates it. I'm surprised. Them little sharp teeth she's got. Well, it's Sunday morning. And it's really blowing. And kind of cold. I don't think you can see what it's really doing from here. But me and uh, Big Jack are having a sit down. With Boo Boo. She's got a weakness. Come here, I'll show you where it is. Stand by. She loves to have her neck scratched underneath her head. <laughs> She's scarier this camera though. She likes to bite too. Got little sharp teeth like razors. She hears mama in there cooking eggs. So I like eggs. Big old Jack. Mmm. Eggs. And sausage, maybe. I'm just patiently waiting for those eggs. That's all I want is eggs this morning. I've already had my breakfast. Eggs are a little added 
dessert. There's a weakness right there on her neck. She loves it. Them teeth. <laughs> what is it? What is it? Behind, in the kitchen? Look, man, dude's in the kitchen. That's dangerous. What do you think? Mandu's in there. You see him? He's big. He's a big old Mandu. Yeah. You see him now, don't you? I'm going to go get him. Mmm. Look cat's in there. I don't like that cat. He hisses at me. What do you think, Cat Man Do? Fat Man Do? Hmm? What do you think of that? What do you think of that? Smart What do you think, Cat Man Do? Mmm. What is that? Mean kitty cat. You better get outside the gate where you can. I got the gates open. Look. Come on, boo boo. Come on, go on out the gate. Leave the dogs alone. That's a good kitty cat. What you looking at? What you looking at, Mandy? I'm looking at that doggy. Doggy right there. There's all kinds of strange noises that go on in this kitchen. Jack, Jack said, I don't care about any noises. Just food. Want to get me a little nap? I'm a terror. It bites my legs as I run. You ought to see her. She's terrible. She chases him around. What are you doing? Got a flea? You bite a flea? What do you think? I want to see that doggy. He's a nice little doggy. Yeah. And then gets to this crack right here in the door. He pulls this part up with his foot like that and pushes it, pushes in. Scooter was in here yesterday. Yeah, I'm working on a web page for myself. It's only in the beginning stages. But it's three pages long now. We go to home. You have three knives that flash across the screen. You have a home page, of course. You have a few knives that just describes what I do. And you go to prices and services. And it gives you hunting knives, so on and so forth. And a fair amount of knives down in here. And it gives you that. Then it gives you the prices. And... 
I just stuck some prices in there to see how the page was going to fill out. I got to change the prices. Like I got straight razors on there. I don't do straight razors, but I'm going to change that to call for contact information. What else I got? I got axes per inch. I got to change that. Uh, a few things I got to change. But like I said, I'm just getting this thing going. Tweezers. I don't buy well, put tweezers in. I don't do tweezers. And we go to the contact page. That's all that is. Got the email address. That's if you want to send something in with a message, you know. Then I got my Facebook and my Twitter and my Yelp contacts at the bottom. I need to add another page over here for events and another blank page. I'll do that. I'm not sure. Tomorrow, maybe. Monday. This www max and I sharpening. All one word. You can see it. Well, you can't see it there. That's where I pulled it up at. But that's what it is right there. Okay. Stand by. Yes, so you just got one. I don't think she's too happy. <laughs> Is she big old Jack? She's in there thinking, what the hell is this thing on my neck, around my chest? Come on out of there. Come on. So I ain't figured this harness thing out. I don't like it. I'm trying to get it off. Damn, she's being elusive. There she is. So I think I'm used to it a little bit now. Maybe. Jack is resting under the fig tree. And Dottie Dog No Name is eating her stick. Right now she's looking at the pigeons on the roof. She hates them. It's a quiet Sunday afternoon. Uh oh, see him? Ooh, she don't like him. That's good though. What do you think, Big O Jack? You don't know what to think, do you? Okay, I guess this is it for Sunday with Dottie. Here goes Jack. See you in a little while. Gotta go to the store. What'd you say? Look at this. What? Thousands and thousands. I can't, I mean, I pull it up, I spray it. Oh. <laughs> it's just... Alligators. Well, there's Mama Kitty. That's where she stays most of the night. Baby Scooter, she sits on the back of the chair like that most of the night. And Big Boo Boo, look at him. He stays. <laughs> he stays over there. Oh, roll back, take it easy. Look how big he is. Fat man, dude. Man. I didn't. I had 
three dozen had a couple <laughs> stolen yesterday. And two good hands took bullets in the exchange. I'm getting heartily tired of this gentleman. It's time we took action. And as he sees George Washington say, I have to step down so the country can move on. Hamilton was a complicated figure, war hero, famous philanderer, political thinker. Enough to know that the best way to dramatize the story what are you is doing? to as close to the facts as I'm possible. Take a little Here's shower. The story of a penniless, orphaned, <laughs> immigrant kid who comes out of nowhere <laughs> and his achievements were absolutely monumental. He really he makes me laugh sometimes, the things he does. He born on the island of uh, Nevis. Uh, he spent Cat his on St. Croix.